The word Maximo in Spanish means maximum, which is a pretty good description of some of the prices at Maximo Cucina Mexicana, which has taken over the former Romano's Macaroni Grill on West Markham Street, just west of Shackelford Road. It's a second concept from the owners of Diablo's Tacos and Mezcaleria, with a more upscale menu and perhaps fancier cocktails. High-end comes at a price. Our first meal came to over $90, over $100 figuring in tax gratuity and the 3.2% credit card surcharge. The good news? On a second visit, with a careful choice of menu items, sticking to a single shareable appetizer and eschewing alcoholic beverages, we cut that bill nearly in half. Interior decor includes a couple of Mexican murals. A mariachi soundtrack makes sure you don't forget you're in a Mexican restaurant. Our appetizers were most successful, particularly the shrimp ceviche, $13.99, marinated in lime juice in a green soup of onions, cilantro, and jalapenos, garnished with an avocado and a chicharron, just spicy enough to give it a kick without inspiring mouth flames. Queso fundido, $11.99, a thin layer of Monterey cheese melted onto a sizzling platter with a surprisingly bland chorizo, came with unexpected slices of fresh avocado and pico de gallo. Our second visit made at the table side guacamole, $10.99, was also a success. A near-perfect balance between avocado flavor and the kick of onions, garlic, salt, and chopped jalapenos. There's a wide choice of options to fill the tacos, three for $12.99, in hard corn or soft flour shells. We mixed and matched. Excellent carnitas, shredded braised pork, overcooked and tough asada beef, and the pollo, well, what showed up in the taco was a blend of indistinct meat and some vegetable matter that might have been green peppers. A purplish tangy tamarind sauce was drizzled onto our ahi tuno tamarindo, 1999, which was overcooked, though not fatally, just enough to make it chewy, and lacking in the promised seasoning. Long strips of differently but not unpleasantly spiced grilled chicken came on top, rather than blended with, the grilled on skillet bell peppers and onions on our Maximo fajitas, 1499. Our steak chimichurri, 2499, was enormous, cooked medium rare as we asked for it, topped with a creamy green sauce that tasted like chimichurri, but wasn't leafy as we were expecting. A major service failure, our entrees came out of the kitchen literally right on top of our appetizers.